I wanted to get in a couple of political or electoral questions here. Uh, moving the state's presidential primary up to February to make us more relevant in the presidential race and also so that the party is not represented best demographically by Iowa and New Hampshire. Um, oh, is it going to make it through your house? Uh, well, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm confident that we, if, you know, with the, if, with, we would get that pass. Uh, you like it? it? It makes some sense. It makes a lot of sense, right? New Jersey is much more yeah. uh, demographically like the country uh, than Iowa or New Hampshire. Um, I mean, great states uh, in their own right, but you know, I think we're a little more reflective of the, the broader uh, diversity that, that that there is in the country, and we're a big state, I and mean, we're you know we're still a uh, an important, a big important state. So uh, I think that makes some sense. You also called for counties and towns to better coordinate their election tallies because there were weird tally swings. I'm thinking of Bergen County particularly had some suspicious had some people suspicious because there were boxes of VBMs that don't get counted until a certain time in this county, but over in this county, it's a different thing. Uh, yeah, I think, you know, during the, during the pandemic, when everything was vote by mail, we allowed the count to start earlier on the vote by mails. Uh, and, uh, you know, I think it's, uh, we want to make sure that all voters have absolute confidence in the, in the, in the system, which is as it is good and secure, and it's been going on for years. So, you know, more people are voting by mail now than than they were than ever before, um, and sometimes and and because of the rules, you can't start to count them until late. But consequently, the results come back late. Uh, I want we want everybody to know that you know those votes. It's just a different way of voting, right? Yeah. Twenty years ago, when I went Christmas shopping, I went to the mall. Now I can go online or I can go to the mall. Uh, it's the same Christmas present. It's the same vote, uh, and so making sure that people have that confidence is, is, is critically important. All right. Assembly Speaker Craig Coughlin, thanks for coming on with us. Enjoy your budget season. <laughs> I'm sure you'll be watching. Thanks, Dave. It's always good to be with you.